Hello everyone. Today is Sunday, January 16th, 2022. Ethiopia Djibouti Railway revenues rise to $86 million in 2021. This article is taken from Haran. The Ethiopia Djibouti Railway, EDR, said it has secured $86.13 million in revenues in the year 2021, showing an increase of 37.5% compared to the previous year. In the year 2021, the 756 kilometer long railway has transported 77,357 containers between Ethiopia and Djibouti port. EDR mentioned the implementation of a railway safety regulation in Ethiopia's, excuse me, Somali region since August 31st, 2021, among other contributing factors as the reason for the rise in revenues. In 2020, the railway had suffered various incidents of vandalism and theft, they recalled. In 2021, however, no significant security relation, uh, related incidents have occurred, the official said. The railway's refrigerated train service helps Ethiopia export its fruits and vegetables to the international market. The railway's freight services also transport fertilizers, wheat, edible oil, and vehicles. Opened in January 2018, replacing the old meter gauge railway, the Ethiopia Djibouti Railway is Africa's first fully electrified transboundary railway. EDR currently transports around 25% of Ethiopia's export and import freight to and from the port of Djibouti, which is entry point to over 90% of Ethiopia's total international trade. So uh, this is another major economic accomplishment happening under the Abiy administration.